Well, it is time for Tomer's Trails, and in Tomer's Trails this morning, a big part of climbing and life is managing your fears. That's what it's about. Old accidents can linger and create doubt for years. Well, and new triumphs can also help erase some of those doubts. Take a look. Not over till you're down. It's been said that the summit is only halfway. It doesn't count unless you make it down alive. And to make it down alive, you have to overcome your fears and focus on the task at hand. And that's why Andy Westmeyer and I are up here climbing the Zorro Kular. I personally have been trying to overcome some fears with that. And uh, just took a little spill a few years ago and for some reason just got in my head and I'm trying to get it out. Andy is working hard to right the ship. He has big climbing plans and they're coming down the pipeline quickly. I think what took us a little by surprise was the fact that when you first step foot on this mountain, it really requires all of your attention. That's John Burkett of the More Than Just Mountains team. We told you about them last month before they left for Denali in Alaska. Well, they were successful and summited. We climb for a cause, we climb for a cure. They're climbing the seven summits to raise $1 million for cystic fibrosis. And like Andy Westmeyer, the More Than Just Mountains team had to overcome their fears. They realized it wasn't the mountain they were conquering, but rather themselves. Denali is a mountain that you don't really conquer. It's one that you have to kind of sneak up on. Indy dreams of climbing Denali soon, and that's something we talk about on our climb up Zorro to the 13,780 foot summit of McNamee Peak. This is pretty cool up here, isn't it? It is. A lot of old wreckage. Yeah. It's hurt, man. We spend about half an hour on top and realize it's only halfway. The trip down is smooth as silk. I feel better than I have in the past, that's for sure. But it's just, I can, it's a nagging fear. It's just, it's just, it's there and it keeps talking to me. And that's all you can do. Keep fighting the fight. It's the sum of all fears, no matter which mountain you're climbing. Yeah, and this is a good story. Uh, congrats to the More Than Just Mountains team for summoning Denali. Awesome mm -hmm. job up there. And, of course, Andy, he's got big dreams. So keep you updated on both of them as we move forward. You're talking about a broader fear, not that moment like when you're on an edge and things are a little dodgy or the wind's blowing and it yeah. looks dangerous. You're talking about that bigger fear, mm -hmm. the things that, that lives within you. Exactly. You know, sort of that long-term things that uh, kind of nag at you for years, uh, something that may have happened 20 years ago could still be affecting you today, your performance today. And, uh, it just takes time, and you just got to keep going through it, moving through it, and, and you know it just helps to erase it a little bit at a time. It's another good yeah. story. Yeah, thanks. It's relatable thanks, to all of us. Yeah. Thank you. Still ahead, almost eight o'clock this morning. A lot.